Hi, Gemini. Welcome to Told Us Love Tarot. I hope you're doing well and healthy and happy. Um, this is for Gemini placements in your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or if you have a lot of Gemini in your chart. Also, if you are a Gemini born the 17th through the 20th, you might want to check out the Gemini Cancer cusp readings because there could be something in there for you. Um... I am connected with a Gemini who has been living and enjoying life and in the and in the enjoyment of that has kind of let things slide around the house or at work or there's just this need to catch up to um, catch up with work maybe things you've put a haven't gotten to yet that you normally would have gotten to by now um housework stuff around the house maybe you've just been enjoying a break from housework but now you're like oh i gotta take care of this <laughs> um i think we're just gonna go with that because i felt that really heavy and like as i was even thinking about that this version of Frank Ocean's thinking about you just started <clears throat> the acoustic version of it and the beginning of it says like a tornado flew around my room before you came so I, even more so it's like ah uh, uh, there must be a mess somewhere somewhere for Gemini so let me know if it resonates Gem Ooh, whoa it came right out it's so funny some signs this the message is, it takes several shuffles and it's like, okay, what's going on here? Why aren't you talking? Gemini wants to talk because we're the communicators of the Zodiac. We got the moon, Cancer energy in reverse. And, um... Five of cups you this is so bizarre to me but i'm just rolling with it because it's what popped into my head last night i am connected right now with like a gemini who has wanted to create or build something with this is one story who has wanted to um build a family maybe has been having fertility issues or um just issues with um coming to terms with a pregnancy coming a full term with the pregnancy <clears throat> and it has something heavily like to do with the female's reproductive system Maybe someone's like menstrual cycle is like all off right now. Look at these two people both looking up. It's like they're both like missing the same thing. Like she's looking towards that kind of flame even though her eyes closed and he's looking up too. It's like they're both praying. This could be people praying together. This could be a Gemini that you're praying for something or someone to come into your life. And little do you know that, well, it would have to be a person unless it's like a place and you're like interviewed somewhere. And little do you know that you and this other individual or this entity are both thinking about each other a lot of what ifs could be a cancer you're dealing with gemini um but if the whole um fertility and um miscarriage um message 
aside from that, which is very specific, this is someone, Gemini, you, you were close with or you knew closely. Um, this could be someone that you were close with a year ago or someone you were close with 10 years ago. It's someone who you, and I know that's so broad, but it's like I can think of a few ways that this could relate. And it's a heavy influence on feeling of like it's someone you knew ages ago, many moons ago. Look at that moon cycle. Many moons ago. And even he's looking up at the moon. And... I feel like it was something, there was a chemistry there, there were feelings, something could have grown but nothing ever did. And I feel like one person is having a what if moment. Maybe this is you, Gemini, watching them. You could be, I mean, I don't see online yet, but I just thought of you could be checking like profiles or whatever. Or this is someone to you, Gemini, who's like watching you. Um, thinking about um, the good times in the past, the love in the past, but then this there was a um, there was a heartbreak, man. Look at those cups falling over, spilled out. And she's crying, I think, right? Yeah, she's crying. This could be legit, like a, a cup, like two people who always had a thing for each other and feelings. Maybe you hung out at night. Maybe you talked at night. Like, maybe you were literally sleeping with this person but nobody knew about it but I just have a um a heavy feeling of like what if so maybe nothing ever happened between you and this person Gemini but you've always wondered what would have happened if you two had gotten together if your secrets or whatever weren't revealed if I don't know why I keep hearing like, what if, what if I had like committed? What if I had like given up wanting to be single? What if I had been with Gemini or Gemini, this is you thinking about them. Like, what if I had just gone back to them, forgiven them, made it work? been really real with them and told them how I felt. Big emphasis on like not talking anymore. I don't think this is recent though. I feel like this happened a long time ago. Could be a friend and like that one was hitting the road while this one's inside crying about it. <clears throat> Uh, Ten of Pentacles reverse. I had just have this feeling of like someone who you thought would be in your life forever. Wheel of Fortune. Someone who you thought like this was happily ever after. Could have been a relationship, but it could have been a friendship too. You looked up to this person, Gemini, or they looked up to you. You, whichever way it resonates, the per, one used to like really um, value the other person's wisdom, advice, direction. <clears throat> the moon reverse clarified by the ace of swords, which is a communication card. So I... Something about like there was you secretly were talking to this person. 
or to me again it, i'm feeling like someone's secretly watching i suspect this is so that was so weird for me to say it like that but i suspect this is someone you wouldn't believe would be um putting in like effort to like keep tabs on you gemini or this is you to them i feel like this is someone that was like indecisive in the past or There was an attraction and there was some communication with this person, but nothing ever um, serious happened. It always stayed non-committal. It's the Queen of Wands reversed, like someone who can't, who knows there's a fiery attraction and, and is very attracted, but doesn't want to get involved. I'm just hearing. So maybe this was you or them but they just didn't want to get involved they didn't want to give up what they were working on or working towards this was very hurtful for you gemini that they wouldn't try they it's like they couldn't even give you the littlest bit of effort page of cups this is water energy um but i just i feel heavily like it was uh someone was like too immature for this so like if you're 28 and you're watching this then we're talking about you when you were 18 or someone you knew when you were 18 i'm 35 i'm talking about someone i knew 10 years ago 25 to me is still a kid <laughs> no offense out there but like i my communication skills have gotten way better my emotional skills like all these things <laughs> evolution i've evolved yeah maybe like someone was like too immature in the past and now they've grown up and it's like they can handle this and the feelings and the attraction that they have or had. Maturity is jumping out to me a lot. Like someone was just too immature. Maybe there was an age difference between you and this person, Gemini. And that is one of the major factors for why it couldn't and didn't work. It's not that either one of you didn't consider like what the future could hold if you were together. But I have a like you it someone was just like there's too big of an age gap here this is just i foresee in the long run like it's just not gonna be pretty so i'm just gonna stick to me and mine and in the process whoever stuck to theirs and like thought the other was too immature and didn't want to do this well that other person has like glowed up bossed up wised up and now maybe this is who's watching, Gemini. You're watching the person who you thought like this is this is too immature. Like I don't want to do this. And now you're seeing them and you're like, oh my gosh, they're like all grown up. They got their shit together. Like, holy shit, you can actually communicate with me now? Like you're not in a shell anymore? Or that's someone to you, Gemini. Like Holy smokes, look at Gemini. Like, he looks great. I haven't seen him looking this great and happy in over 10 years. You know what I mean? Someone you knew who knew you years ago is watching or trying to communicate or is communicating with you now. And they've noticed a growth from this bashful or immature bashful person or bashful and shy person or punk fresh attitude into this like bossed up individual 
who is in control of her his or her emotions and is a very caring individual and that can be like seen maybe it's even talked about like how much this person has evolved or like how much they've grown up because they're being watched I'm hearing like, they didn't think you had it in you, Gemini, Gemini, or you didn't think they had it in them. Yeah, it's like they got a power wash of their life. And it's like they're a totally new person. Ooh, the Queen of Wands reversed again. That's fire energy. I, I get a like, I'm very attracted to you. I think you're awesome, but I don't want to have a relationship. It could be, I don't want to have a relationship period, or I don't want to have a relationship with you because I've learned many times the with you is the really, really, really hard, painful part for people to hear or accept. So we just say, I don't want to be in a relationship. So you can like own that you're ending the relationship for your own reasons and not have them feel like it's because of them. And I feel that that's what was here. Like, that was either them to you, Gemini, or you to them in the past. Like, <clears throat> I think you're really alluring. I think you're hot shit, but I just don't think in the long run, this would be something good for me to invest in. And they didn't. They didn't invest with you or you didn't invest with them. Cause this is the same card, 10 of Pentacles. They went on, someone went a different route and had a different life or is doing that now and you, Gemini, are not a part of it or they're not a part of your life. Wow, Gemini. Let's get one more. Please let me know if this resonates. If it doesn't, check out your other signs. Wow, Wheel of Fortune upright over here and Wheel of Fortune reverse just came out. A lot of double cards in my readings lately. It's wild the chariot reversed and never went anywhere you someone may have waited someone may have thought like in good time in fate like it'll come around he'll come back she'll come back but they never did they never did we saw this earlier too like the man looking up at the moon this is the same same one so where there was, remember at the beginning it was talking about these two people who have an attraction, but nothing ever happened. Like, I even said you you could have been actually hooking up with this person on the sly, but I feel like there was more here than what met the eye and not everyone knew it, except for you two, how deep you guys felt about each other or how strong the vibe was, the connection. One person really, really wanted it to happen, maybe even tried to offer their cup of love and felt like it was faded and it was bound to happen and it was going to happen, but it never went anywhere. Maybe someone moved away, but I just got the like, it didn't, this is more cancer energy. So you could be dealing with a cancer or you're a Gemini cancer. <laughs> I have a, this is someone who really wanted this to work, who really wanted it to go somewhere. And it just, who prayed for it. You could have gone to, and gotten tarot, re, tarot readings about this person or they did about you. A lot of secret feelings here, but in the long run, I think... Um, it was like too much 
maybe too much lust and not enough emotion or I'm even hearing like there was too much emotion and not enough lust maybe someone was very uh clingy and that like worried someone so they decided I I'm just not I think you're hot shit. I really like you. You're very attractive to me. The sex was great if you actually hooked up with this person or you really, really, really wanted to be with that person. Um, but it was like decided not to invest. Someone decided like this just isn't where I'm going to invest or who I want to invest with and they didn't so this was either you gemini or them and i feel like either you or them has a partner a spouse or a girlfriend or a significant other and the other one is single and every once in a while still thinks fondly of that time and wonders like what if what if what if all these other options had happened and we hadn't had to part ways? What if I hadn't accepted that offer? What if I hadn't believed what was being said to me? What if I actually gave it a chance? Or this is someone thinking that about you, Gemini. Gemini, what if they had just given it a chance? Gemini, if this resonates for you, please let me know. Um. Again, if your birthday is the 17th through the 20th of June, you might want to check out the Gemini Cancer readings. I'm about to go do that one. And look for my Valentine's readings coming soon. I'll see you next time. Love you. Bye.